G'day members and fans, Jason Taylor here to give you a bit of an update about the season and where we're at. Uh, certainly not happy with our, our last four weeks and, and our performances, um, but we'll get to that. Uh, a great start to the year though, uh, to win nine from 11 games uh, was probably slightly above expectations. You know, you all know, those of you who follow closely, you all know what it's like with New South Wales Cup and the ins and the outs and, and um, and we probably had 11 games there to start the year where we were very consistent, very consistent with players in the team, very consistent with the way we played. Uh, we had a heap of travelling to do, but none of that mattered. Uh, the boys had a spring in their step and, um, and, and it really clicked. Uh, but that hasn't been the case in the last month, right? So, um, and, and when I say that hasn't been the case, that, that bit of consistency uh, has disappeared a little bit, um, you know, a number of different guys in and out of the team. Uh, great opportunity for some of our guys to, to get NRL experience, like Junior Pauga playing on the, the wing for the Roosters right now, doing an absolutely amazing job. We've, uh, you know, we saw what a job he did uh, before he was given that opportunity here at the Bears and, and absolutely killed it. So uh, really shouting out to Junior and the way he's going. So I really want to see that continue. Uh, but that's meant that, um, you know, it does become a little bit harder for us. But, you know, Junior came to the Bears knowing there's an opportunity to play with the Roosters and that's what he's doing. And that's what we provide uh, at this level. It's, um, it's really important. Um, so the last month, just, it, it's not good enough. Uh, simply, uh, what we did first part of the year was defend really well, uh, and that's disappeared um, on us. Our, our, you know, it's one thing conceding tries, but we've just been conceding soft tries, uh, and it, it hasn't been good enough. We are working really hard on that. Uh, the, the combinations of the guys is really important, and, and getting guys at training is important. Um, but we can do better, and, and when I say we can do better, we actually had some improvement on Sunday. Um, so the previous three weeks were, were rock bottom for us in regards to our defensive performances, but Sunday was an improvement. Um, those first two tries weren't good enough, absolutely not good enough, but um, you know, we showed for the rest of that game that we've made improvements. Uh, and, and I think if you, anyone who watched that game, the fight that you saw from the guys, um, you know, we gave up one try in the second half, which was a, a 100 metre intercept try. That took the score to 22 to four, and the boys could have easily put the cue in the rack there, but they never did. Um, and they talked to me after the game about the fact that they got behind the line there, and they said, "We will not be giving up here. We're going to keep fighting." Um, and you know, they finished off really strongly. It was great to see, uh, and I'm really confident that we take that form, you know, a second half form from the weekend, uh, into the remainder of the year, and particularly into our next game against West Magpies. Um, the bye couldn't have come at a better time. A number of guys played in that game on the weekend with some injuries that, uh, that did hold them back. So we get a chance to take a break, uh, just sit back and, and relax a little bit um, for the players. Uh, just unwind and then we'll come back uh, bigger and stronger. So really looking forward to your support. We've got 10 games to go, six of those are at North Sydney Oval. Uh, please come down and support us as we, um, as we fight hard to get ourselves into, the, into that top five. Uh, for the back end of the year and, um, and have a real crack at it.